Hello, friends and not yet friends. Today on Mary's Test Kitchen, we're gonna make a classic tasting mayonnaise that is totally vegan and delicious. This mayo is thick, creamy, slightly tangy, and simply perfect for all your sandwich needs. The ingredients are just like with regular mayonnaise. Vinegar, mustard, oil, lemon juice, and then we get to the weird things. Black salt, aka kalanema, which gives an eggy flavor, and aquafaba, which replaces the traditional egg. Where do you get this mysterious aquafaba? Well, it's probably in your cupboard already. Check out this video to see what the hey aquafaba is, or this one to make your own from scratch. So once you have your ingredients measured out, grab your food processor or blender and dump in everything except the oil. Let's that all together, just combine, then you can start adding your oil in a slow, steady stream, just as if you are making regular mayonnaise. This food processor works perfectly because of these little holes at the top that seem to be designed just for this purpose. By the way, I'm trying this new thing where I link all the specialty ingredients and equipment that I'm using in the description below, so you can read all about them and buy them online if you like. And if you buy from that link, I do get a small commission, so that helps out this channel. I'm pulsing this only a few seconds at a time because otherwise this thing will overheat. But it doesn't take long for the mixture to thicken. When all your oil has been incorporated, pulse just a few more seconds and then voila! Thick, creamy vegan mayonnaise from scratch. At this point, give yourself a pat on the back, then go ahead and taste to see if you want to add any salt or lemon juice or vinegar or anything else to your preference. And then put it on whatever you like for that matter, not just sandwiches. This is your vegan mayo and there are no rules. Except maybe keep in mind that there aren't extra preservatives, so store this in a clean jar in the fridge and it should keep for up to about two weeks. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching, friends. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe for more easy vegan recipes each week. Bye for now.